tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Normally, when people see them on stage, they, they, they are performing serious roles or maybe in a musical or some serious theater acting. Pero ngayong gabi, medyo maiiba tayo because uh, after the pandemic started, itong apat na to, napaka-creative talaga. And uh, nagkaroon sila ng insight na why don't we reinvent ourselves? Kasi wala naman mga ibang musicals or uh, theater productions dahil sa pandemya, nagsara lahat ng theater companies and no shows. So the digital space now has a great show. And tonight, special tayo kasi nandito lahat sila sa Let's Chat with Tita Gracie. So, siguro na in-intrigue yung mga guests, yung mga audience ko ngayong gabi. These guys are actors. Pa, paano kayo na, nag-form ng grupo ng The Mad Men? Who would like to answer this? How did you find each other? Chino? Titray, ikaw na. Ikaw na, Titray. Titray. Ah, so, uh, ni Titray. Hindi, yung, uh, how we found each other is kind of blurry. Kasi, you know, we have the same, we have common friends and uh, hindi naman kami, you know, and when you have a show, magkikita, nakikita kita rin kami. Uh, so, but how we formed this Mad Men uh, group was, uh, it's an it's a, a brainchild of Luna Grino, Grino in Ocean. Uh, she thought of coming up with, uh, with a group na magpa-perform sa, uh, what is going on? Oh, the one night stand, which happens every Tuesday, every first Tuesday of the month, nung ano, nung wala pang pandemic. Sa, oh, oh, sa para, mang, parang yeah. the cabaret show, oh, well, parang, well, parang musical. Twelve yeah. monkeys, twelve monkeys. Mm -hmm. Sa twelve monkeys. Uh, twelve monkeys and then sa El Pueblo. Sa El Pueblo. Yeah. So Luna, uh -huh. it was Luna's brainchild. And by the way, Luna is also from United Hills Village. Yes. Um, Correct. Bahay, we grew up in one block, you know. My best friend lives down the street from her, but Luna's very creative. And uh, I think she saw something in each one of you that uh, inspired her to put that group together. Uh, the title, Mad Men, is very intriguing because usually on stage, people see you in different roles. Maybe you're not even recognizable as individual actors. Because seldom are you on your, by your, you know, on your own, with your own persona. You're always taking on uh, different roles, right? Mm. Very true, yep. yes. Actually, yep. nagkita-kita... Na Nagsama-sama kami actually sa isang show din bago nagsimula yung Mad Men. Yung Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Kat, lahat kami galing doon sa show na yon Kaya kung nakita mo si Tito Ray doon, iba din talaga itsura niya doon. Oo, siya yung so, Bang Bang. <laughs> <laughs> Tapos yung, yung do, doon naman sa pangalan daw nung Mad Men, ang, ang totoong logic pala noon, kasi akala ah, namin iba eh. Ang totoong logic pala noon, kasi ah, parang acronym siya. Abrevi, ano siya? Uh, ang ibig sabihin daw noon, Ano daw? Mature Actors, actors Daw. Daw. Men. <laughs> kaya Mad Men. Okay. So, Unang-una, kaya kami 10th anniversary. Alam nyo naman ang takbo ng time. Parang surreal ngayon, di ba? Ang takbo ng time ngayong pandemic na to. Mabilis. Parang taon na yung dumaan. Parang taon na. So kaya, yung isang taon, one week. Isang taon, one week. So naging 10 episodes. Naging 10 years na kaagad. Ang bilis-bilis. Kasi nga, pinag-uusapan namin last time, yung last episode, kung naaalala pa nila, yung the good old days na pwede pang magpagupit. <laughs> sa barbero. Ngayon di na eh. Parang it's an alien concept now eh. Ngayon, Ikaw definitely hindi na. Oo. Hindi na bumili ng bago sa plan. Hindi na. Tapos yung... Hindi na. Uh, yung aming ano, yung, uh, yung aming uh, show, since uh, gusto namin masustain siya ng matagal at duma dumami pa ng ano, uh, yung friend namin na uh, parang honorary madman namin, si, si Sam... Sam Sewell, para nag-suggest din siya sa amin na bakit hindi kayo magpa-challenge o magpa-contest yung parang if you reach if you reach this number of likes dun sa inyong Facebook page, you will do something. Ako, I started Kasi, my theater when I was in high school. Eh. Nagkaroon kami ng musical sa La Salzobel na directed by Tita Bibot and assistant niya si Michael, si Jaime and then ang musical director namin si Tita Baby. Ang, ang, wow. ang choreographer namin si Dina Aquino. And then afternoon, wow, South Pacific, wow, wow. 
And that's a South cool Pacific yun. Yeah, super sa so Rizal Theater pa yun, Rizal Theater. So wow. it was South Pacific and I played cable. So sumali lang ako kasi exempted kami for one quarter, hindi kami pumapasok sa eskwela, puro rehearsal lang for one quarter. That's why I joined I joined the <laughs> And then after that, after that, yeah. tinab- sinabihan ako ni Tita Bibot bak- kung gusto ko mag uh, repertory. So I joined them for uh, I think for one show lang eh. and then I stopped because I became national team for karate. And then when I retired from karate, that's when I came back. Ang nakita kong difference ngayon is yung uhaw yung Pinoy audience sa original material. Yun. Tama. Mm. Tama. Very appreciative yung, sila ngayon. Oo, oh, grabe yung reception sa El Bimbo, sa Apo, Rock of Ages. So, Wait, Wait, let me just say, so, talking about, uh, you're to, you mentioned El Bimbo, uh, gusto ko lang sabihin sa mga viewers natin sa abroad na nakikinig ngayon, yung El Bimbo will be again uh, streamed online. Soon. Wow. So, yes. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Soon. Yeah. Soon. 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 Uh-huh. Pay-per-view naman. naman. Pay-per-view. Yeah, and, well, everyone was. Everyone was. Yeah. We put all our heart and soul into making this project really, really, ano, you know, excellent. Gano yeah. naman lahat ng theater productions dito sa Pilipinas yeah. na lang puhunan talaga ng theater actor na Pinoy is yung puso talaga eh. Kasi yung kulang natin sa ba- sa budget, sa production, puso talaga yung pang 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 ano natin, pang pang, sak- pang sakit doon. Wow. Yes. Yung ginagawa namin sa show is actually us in a uh, dressing room setting. Ganun kami mag-usap. Ganun kami maglokahan. So it's it's okay. like parang wait, our audience would always say parang para kung para kung nasa dressing room ah kasi usually yung mga nanonood sa amin, mga nakasama na namin sa theater. So yun ang nami-miss nila sa amin yung yung bantering na mga you know, mga ganung kalokohan. Yeah. <laughs> so, so even if Y- yun yung mga mga ideas doon lumalabas yung mga ideas ng 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 Mad Men na, na oh, oh. Oh, oh, everything is just being being silly yeah, yeah. so spontaneous yeah pero may konting planning naman yun may konting uh, planning konti lang uh, uh, konting planning mga, kami. Mga, kasi nas nas stress kami lalo na si Julian kawawa naman uh, yeah. kasi si Julian yung gumagawa lahat ng video siya yung nag edit Si Julian. Yung planning. Oh, oh. Uh, yung, yung planning namin mga 30 minutes gan. <laughs> <laughs> 30 minutes. Stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on Z81 Radio, Manila.